Welcome to Vintage Road and Rail. I would like to thank you for joining me for the first episode of Will It Run? Um, oftentimes um, I go to train shows, um, local hobby shops, and even buy uh, used locomotives off of uh, eBay. And many times there's no way of knowing if these um, work or not. Um, at my local hobby shop they'll usually have some test tracks so that you know they can put it on there and see what happens. But with eBay, oftentimes the seller will tell you it's untested. They don't know if it'll run or they'll advertise it as non-working. And pretty much about the same thing with train shows. Uh, sometimes they know if they run or not, sometimes they don't. So it's a bit of a gamble. So when I get them home, I never know what's, you know, what's going to happen. Are they going to work or are they just going to sit there? So I thought I'd uh, start up a little series of quick videos of whenever I acquire one of these locomotives. Um, just uh, shoot a quick video of it on the track and see if it goes or if it just sits there. So today I was at um, my local hobby shop called the train station and I picked up a River Rossi uh, EMD E8. Um, nice looking engine, looks to be complete, but it was only three dollars. So, so I have a feeling that when I stick this on the track it's not going to run. So stay tuned and let's go over to the train table and see what happens. Okay, so I've moved my camera over to the uh, train table. Very bare train table at the moment, but has some track on it, so it'll do the job. And here is the River Rossi EMD E8. I wasn't sure if it was an E8 or an E9, but one of the things that I looked online was that if this headlight was recessed a little bit, that was an E8. If it was flush, it was an E9. So this um, appears to be recessed, so it's... Uh, I'm assuming an E8. But anyway, so here's this uh, River Rossi engine. It's Union Pacific. And looks to be in pretty good shape. The front uh, horn hook coupler is there. The two horns on top are there. I don't see any cracks or anything on the top or on this side. So I'm going to flip it over. And again, no cracks or anything. Horn hook is complete on uh, the back of the locomotive. And even the trucks, they have the sides present. Everything looks to be good. And if you notice that sticker there, I'll flip it over. There, if I can get it to focus. Three dollars. So my assumption is that it doesn't work, but let's um, set it on the track and see what happens. I'm going to hit pause and be right back. Okay, I am back, and here is our E8. It is on the track, and I've made sure that it's on there really good, and I've got the power supply turned on, so let's see what happens. Well, it's about half power and nothing. Let's give it a little push. Nothing's happening. All the way up. And again, nothing is happening. Okay. Let's turn off the power. And I can see why that uh, locomotive was uh, $3. Um, it does not work. But, looks like a couple of screws there in the bottom will take it off. So, when I have a few moments, a little extra time, I'll take it apart and see what happens. Alright, well, I'd like to thank you very much for um, watching. And if you want to see more videos like this, uh, please hit that like button and subscribe and hit the notification bell so you'll be alerted as to uh, when I put up a new video. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.